Hello, Owen. It's Nana Terry. I have a story for you. The story today is called The Grinny Granny Donkey. I bought it for you. Okay, The Grinny Granny Donkey. You have two other <clears throat> uh, donkey books. It's called The Wonky Donkey and then The Baby Wonky Donkey. And I read those to you earlier. Let's see what the Grinny Granny Donkey is about. There once was a sweet donkey who lived on the heath. She was so funny with her false teeth. It'd be fun if donkeys could have false teeth, wouldn't it? Hee-haw, but her teeth kept falling out. Hmm. She was a clunky donkey. There was a sweet donkey who lived on the heath. She was so funny with her false teeth, but her teeth kept falling out. She loved to sip her favorite brew and dunk her biscuits in it too. She was a donkey drinky clunky donkey. There once was a sweet donkey who lived on the heath. She was so funny with her false teeth. She says, hee-haw. But her teeth kept falling out. She loved to sip her favorite brew, dunk her biscuits in it too, and fell asleep in the afternoon sun. She was a zonky, donkey, drinky, clunky donkey. Look at her. She's sleeping. There once was a sweet donkey who lived on the heath. She was so funny with her false teeth, but her teeth kept falling out. She loved to sip her favorite brew, dunk her biscuits in it too, fell asleep in the afternoon sun, then go for walks with her jewelry on. She was a clinky, clanky, zonky, donkey, drinky, clunky, donkey. <laughs> That's a mouthful, look at her. <clears throat> Okay, with all that jewelry, she kind of reminds me of me. I don't have false teeth yet, Owen, but you know, the jewelry I can get on board with. There once was a sweet donkey who lived on the heath. She was so funny with her false teeth. Hee-haw, she says, but her teeth kept falling out. She loved to sip her favorite brew, dunk her biscuits in it too, fell asleep in the afternoon sun, go for walks with her after, with her jewelry on, and she always dressed smartly. She was a swanky, clinky, clanky, zonky, donkey, drinky, clunky, donkey. <laughs> Look at her. She's cute. Okay. There once was a sweet donkey who lived on the heath. She was so funny with her false teeth. Hee-haw, she says, but her teeth kept falling out. She loved to sip her favorite brew dunk her biscuits in it too, fall asleep in the afternoon sun, go for walks with her jewelry on, dress very smartly, and she played her banjo to relax. She was a plunky, plinky, swanky, clinky, clanky, zonky, dunkly, drinky, clunky, donkey. <laughs> That's a mouthful. Oh, and when you get older, I want you to try to say that. I want you to read it and send me a video of you reading it. There once was a sweet donkey who lived on the heath. She was so funny with her false teeth. Hee-haw, she says, but her teeth kept falling out. She loved to sip her favorite brew, dunk her biscuits in it too, fall asleep in the afternoon sun, go for walks with her jewelry on, dress smartly and play her banjo to relax. But, if she hadn't had a visit from her family in a while, she would sometimes get grumpy and cranky. She does remind me of me. Okay, let's see what the next thing says. She was a cranky, plunky, plinky, swanky, clinky, clanky, zonky, donkey, drinky, clunky, donkey. Ooh, look, at, she does look a little bit grouchy. Okay, for the record, I don't get grouchy, Owen. I get sad, but I don't get grouchy. But she look kind of grouchy. Okay, let's see what happens next. 
There once was a sweet donkey who lived on a heath. She was so funny with her false teeth. What does she say, Owen? Can you say it? Hee-haw. I bet you could make those sounds. Hee-haw. Try it. But her teeth kept falling out. She loved to sip her favorite brew, dunk her biscuits in it too, fall asleep in the afternoon sun, go for walks with her jewelry on, dress smartly, play her banjo to relax, and sometimes she got grumpy and cranky. But when her son Wonky turned up with her cute granddaughter Dinky, that cranky granny donkey got so many cuddles and kisses that she couldn't get the smile off her face for weeks. Oh, there she is. That's how I feel when I get to see you. She was a grinny, granny, plunky, plinky, swanky, clinky, clanky, donkey, donkey, drinkly, clunky, donkey. <laughs> there she is, hugging her granddaughter, whose name is Dinky, and there's her son, whose name is Wonky. Hmm. There was a grinny granny donkey who lived on the heath. She smiled so much that you could see her false teeth. Say it with me if you can. Hee-haw. Can you say it, Owen? Hee-haw. Well, that was a fun book. Did you like it? I liked it. The grand reminds me of me. I, I like jewelry. Can't play a banjo. Oh, there's Grandpa. Say hi to Owen. Hi, hey, Owen. Didn't mean to interrupt your book. He came in the. Yeah, we're at the end of the story, so he didn't interrupt, did he? He came right at the end, and that's okay. We're getting ready to drive to your house. It's the day after Thanksgiving, and we're gonna bring you guys some cherry pie. So we're getting ready to drive up to you. So I wanted to read the book to you so that I could give it to you and then you could see it in person and maybe mom or dad would read it to you. I love these dinky donkey books. They were just fun. So I picked it up for you. All right, I'm gonna see you really soon. I'm looking forward to it. Even if I just get to wave to you from a distance, this, this COVID virus, but I hope you're having a good Thanksgiving with mom and dad and I'll see you soon. Love you, Owen, bye-bye.